Um, one thing we know also, from another bit of neuroscience is that what they found is that people have a better memory for things they've written down than that which they've typed in really? a classroom setting. That's wow. been a finding in neuroscience. And what neuroscientists have found is the reason for that is that because we can type faster uh, than we can write longhand. And we could type almost at the speed of what's being spoken. And so basically what we're doing is we're just essentially quickly processing, but not encoding what's being said. Okay. And um, when you write something longhand, like when you journal, you actually have to articulate entire thoughts in your head and they become encoded in your memory in a much stronger fashion. And so basically you're programming yourself in another, in another sense of the word, when you journal, you're programming your brain to perceive a situation, you know, through a certain lens or perspective, and it becomes much more real and concrete. And in some ways you start to live your way into that, if that makes any sense. And, and what do you see people do in terms of review what's being written? Is that important at all? Or even the mm -hmm. act of writing itself is good enough? Or do you see people coming back uh, every week or every month to really make sense of what they've written? Um, it seems like the act of writing itself is the most important piece, but then, you know, reviewing it further encodes it as well. Um, so I think the research had much more to do with the actual act of writing. Um, mm. But what we know is that when people can reinforce that through reading it. So we always ask people to read what they wrote um, after they've done it uh, in our curriculum. Um, and it really helps bring a lot of clarity. For the listeners, I would just invite you to try that. You don't have to do this extensively, but you know, for three or four days of a week for you know, seven minutes, five minutes even each, um, give yourself a prompt. I'm at my best when, I hope for, and just let yourself write and experiment with this and see what emerges. It might surprise you.